Welcome to Portland, Oregon, where Kerner Camera Systems is proudly hosting a group of select cinematographers for a demo of the Shotover G1, a professional cinema gimbal system. Here, along with its owner, Attain Media. Let's check it out. My name is JP, I'm from Shotover Camera Systems, and this is Baby G, the Shotover G1. It's a three axis gyro stabilized gimbal that we spent a lot of time making sure it works with everyone. So there's been a lot of third party integration. We communicate with Reds, Aries, Canons, Phantoms, Fujinon lenses, small HD monitors, pretty much all of the, the top brands out there. We've all come together and make sure that our stuff works together. We're definitely known for stability at shot over. Stability in Horizon is always gonna be rock solid, but going ahead into the future, it's about everyone in the film industry working together to make sure all of our products can communicate with each other properly. I'm pretty proud to say the G1 probably has had more third-party integration than anything out there. This is my G1, and I use this to film off-road racing, road racing, road cores, work a lot with Chevy, Honda, and a lot of different suspension companies, and really, we get to use this thing to showcase what the vehicles can really do on the road because we can do 100 miles an hour, 120 millimeters zoomed in, and we still get a buttery smooth shot. So it really showcases what the vehicles are, what they can do. And this thing is a workhorse, man. We put it through its paces for sure. So when we originally designed the G1, it was actually for a drone. We wanted to build the most advanced drone in the world. The result of that was the gimbal can be pretty much mounted on anything. It weighs about 10 pounds without the fizz and it's been mounted to motorcycles, to cars, it's been mounted to small aircraft, it's been mounted to jet skis and snowmobiles and cable cams and cranes. Pretty much anything that moves, we will have a way to mount it on there and we rate the system at 120 mils at 100 miles an hour. So those numbers were real important to us because there's no other product out there that's currently doing that in this size. This is our, our go-to gimbal for everything we do, really. Shot Over makes an incredible product. It's not just a product, it's a customer service. It's everything about them. They're great people and they help you with whatever you need help with. It was smooth and uh, demonstrably steady. Yeah. Absolutely uh, powerful motors, which are what you're paying for. It makes sense. The low number of cases that are involved with all the utility that it delivers, it's huge for uh, just thinking about logistics on being on the road, setup breakdown. It's not adding much, if anything, to slow down your day. Um, for all the benefits that it brings. It seems pretty damn efficient. We did the earthquake checks and then we went over bumps. When we were going over the bumps, you couldn't see any movement. It was still really steady. And that was a wow moment. I think all of us in the car were like, that's amazing. So it sets the G1 apart from other gimbals. It's basically one power source for everything. As you can see, all the cables are being plugged directly into the brain. We don't like GAC. So traditionally with handheld gimbals and other smaller gimbals, you're adding an MDR or you're adding a wireless transmitter. All that stuff we've already built in. And then if you still want to use a Preston or anything like that, you still can. You simply just plug it into the controller. We don't want you to get out of the vehicle and go to the head to address a problem. Everything should be done right at your control. It's really nice with the G1. It's easy to set up. It takes about 45 minutes or so by myself to fully set it up on a car, ready to go. You have controller, ground station, gimbal, um, you rig up the camera, pop it in. I power with a 2000 watt generator, drop it on. Cool thing is you could have a tech, you could have a driver, and the tech can be an operator. So you're, you're set two people crew for uh, magical shots that used to take you know 10 people on a crew to get. Nowadays we could get with uh, two people. The G1 is also a turnkey system. What we've done is we provided power and data cables for all the modern cameras. So RAD DSMC2, Airy Mini, uh, Phantom 4K, the C500, pretty much the whole Sony line because they're all the same stuff. You can actually communicate with the camera via their remote control. It integrates into our controller. So as far as selecting power, you don't need to worry about selecting power. All you need to do is grab the appropriate cable, plug it into the port in the back, plug it into the camera, and we'll do all the math for you. And the same goes for video. However you want to run video, we have encoded video, we have an HD-SDI slip ring, we have a fiber optic slip ring, or we can do it wirelessly. Um, that also goes for control and the data. So I could have um, the camera controller and the gimbal controller and all the fizz and the video running wirelessly with one stream. 
And this is important because we don't like RF pollution in environments on the film sets. With this, you can have your own dedicated channel um, and you can switch it too and make sure you're not on anyone else's channel. But again, it's only one RF stream. So that's a big advantage for a lot of people, especially the cable cam guys and guys that have their cameras in places where you actually can't get cables up to it. This is my favorite rental spot to go by far, without a doubt. I mean, look how beautiful it is here. So if you're looking for cameras right here, that's where you rent them, Kerner. Thanks to Kerner Camera. Thank you.